Jake Mintz, Cespit is Family Barbecue here with MLB.com beat reporter for the Baltimore Orioles, Brittany Giroli. Brittany, thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule to join me here today. You're welcome. It's been a busy morning for the <laughs> Orioles. Busy, busy with all those rumors. Very busy. Now we're going to go and do some MLB superlatives, right? So we're going to start off with who on the Orioles is the best dressed. Well, this is tough. And as okay. you know, players have been campaigning all year to win this superlative right here, right now. Right. They knew this was um, going to happen. They've been lining my pockets right. all year. I think I'm going to have to go with Manny Machado okay. uh, because you know, they're all dressed fairly well. I think their wives make sure of that, their girlfriends right. make sure of that. But Manny takes it a step further. He takes risks. If me and you were on the red carpet at the Oscars, we would say that Manny Machado is a risk taker. He wow. wears colors. He wears shapes. He is not afraid to step outside of the box. Not what are you wearing, Manny, but rather <laughs> who are you wearing? <laughs> Next question for you, who on the Orioles is the best DJ? Who is the oh. team DJ who's in charge of the Oxford? The team DJ would be Chris Davis, okay. who is probably runner-up in that best dressed. I want to make sure he okay. knows that he is included right. here. Uh, your contributions were included here, Chris Davis, but Adam Jones as well. Depending on the mood, depending on the win, both of those guys kind of set the tone. Those rookies know. You don't got five years in the league. You're not touching those those, right. those Don't touch, don't know, touch don't the touch. ox court. Don't, don't touch, touch the ox court. Five, Just ten look. rights. Uh, next question, who on the Orioles do you think is most likely to be a manager at some point down the road? Well, if we can put a little asterisk by it, because he's not technically an Oriole anymore, I'm going to go with J.J. Hardy. He's an Oriole forever in our hearts. In now. our hearts, right. yes, in our hearts. Um, he's a guy who is quiet, understated, had a huge impact on Jonathan Scope, on Machado, uh, really knows the game, loves the game, would love to talk about defensive metrics on any of these guys any day of the week. If he doesn't retire to Montana in a house with little running water and no electricity, Sounds great. Uh, then so I think rustic. his his backup plan, I would imagine, would be to be a manager. Got it. Who is the most interesting Oriole? This is tough. A lot of them are interesting. Again, this is another one. They've been campaigning since spring training. Brittany picked me for most interesting Oriole. Right. Yes. Uh, and I think I'm going to have to go with closer Zach Britton. Okay. Because Why? You know, relievers are a little weird anyway, yes. but this dude is super weird. Uh, and you can tell him that. You can tell him, Zach, you know what? You, you, your pitching has sucked lately. You're not wow. very good. Uh, you can make fun of him. He'll give it right back to you. This is a guy who has a starting pitcher. They had to move his locker because he would spin around in that chair, beg people to talk to him. How many major league baseball very players few. Very few. starting you, pitchers? Never. Exactly. Usually, like, on someone's start day, it's like Fort Knox. Like, you don't get anywhere near them. Exactly. Right, last one for you. Who is the class clown of the Orioles? Darren O'Day. Okay. He's smart. He's funny. A lethal combination. Uh, that segue skit with Orioles manager Buck Showalter, everyone saw it. Everyone loved it. Uh, he's always got little tricks up his sleeve. He's got four or five jokes running out of time. Uh, recently, played a joke on a player that lasted about a week, but the player didn't even notice, honestly. It was myself and another reporter. Probably the biggest scoop we're going to get all winter, let's be honest. If, if you're a sidearm relief pitcher and you're not messing with your teammates, <laughs> you don't belong on the floor. What are you doing? Simple as that. I'm Jake Mintz, Brittany Thank you so much for joining us. This has been the MLB Superlatives, and we'll see you guys next time.